Let's look into some of the important terms in ITIL service management. ITIL Information Technology Infrastructure Library is a set of best practices being practiced by most of the infrastructure service providers to deliver services to the customers to meet their business needs within predicted cost and quality. Service Service is a means of delivering value to customers by achieving customers' desired results while working within given constraints. Service level It is measured and reported achievement against one or more service level targets. Service level agreement It is agreement between service provider and customer. The SLA describes the IT service, documents service level targets and specifies the responsibilities of provider and customer. Service strategy Service strategy helps to design, develop and implement service management as organizational capabilities and strategic assets as well. It enables a service provider to consistently outperform competitive alternatives over time, across business cycles, industry disruptions and changes in leadership. Service model Service model is the high-level description of the service and components required to deliver that service. Service portfolio Service portfolio is the set of services provided by the service provider. Service catalog Service catalog is the set of specific services being provided by service provider to a specific customer. Customer portfolio Customer portfolio is used to record all customers of IT service provider. Demand management Demand management is very important and critical process in service strategy. It helps to understand customer demand for services so that appropriate capacity can be provisioned to meet those demands. Pattern of business activity It is an extremely important activity achieved by knowing customer how they operate and future requirement they might need. Service design Service design provides a blueprint for the services. It not only includes designing of new service but also devises changes and improvements to existing ones. Operational Level Agreement OLA is an agreement between IT service provider and another part of same organization. Service Level Report It gives insight into a service provider's ability to deliver the agreed service quality. Service Level Requirements It is a document containing the requirements for a service from the client viewpoint, defining detailed service level targets. Service Asset Service assets are the resources and capabilities owned by the service provider enabling it to deliver service to the customer. Configuration item Configuration item is subset of service assets and have direct impact on delivering services. All servers, networks, applications that have impact on production are known as configuration item. Service assets and configuration management it deals with maintaining up-to-date and verified database of all assets and SIS which are also made available to other service management processes. Change Change refers to modifying existing services. Event Event is defined as detectable occurrence that has significance for the delivery of IT service. Events are created by configuration item or the monitoring tools. Incident Incident is defined as any disruption in IT service. Incident can be reported either through the service desk or through an interface from event management to incident management tools. Service request Service request refers to demand by the users. These requests can be regarding small changes, changing the password, installing additional software application, requesting information etc. Problem problem is defined as unknown cause of one or more incident. Known error. Known error is well identified problem with its cause and resolution. It is stored in known error database KEDB. Core service. A service that delivers the basic outcomes desired by one or more customers. A core service provides a specific level of utility and warranty. Service provider. An organization supplying services to one or more internal customers or external customers. Service provider is often used as a short form for IT service provider. There are three types of service provider available. Internal provider. Share service provider. External service provider. 
function. A team or a group of people and the tools they use to carry out one or more processes or activities. IT help desk operation would be a good example for this. Underpinning contract, UP. Underpinning contract can be defined as a contract with an external supplier who supports the IT organization in their delivery of services. Pattern of business activity. PBA are workload profiles describing the demand for particular services. PBAs are an important tool used by demand management for anticipating and influencing service demand. Workload profile of one or more business activities. Varies over time. Represents changing business demands. User profiles. User profiles are defined in the context of the roles and responsibilities within the organization for people functions, processes and applications. Pattern of user demand for IT services. Each user profile includes one or more PBA. Hope this video is helpful. If you like this video, please hit the like button and share your comments. Stay subscribed for more knowledge sharing videos. Thank you for watching this video.